My name is Taylor Jones with Eberl Claim Service and you're watching Adjuster TV. In this video, Taylor Jones and her team from Eberl Claim Service give us a tour of their state-of-the-art Dallas training center, starting now. This is Adjuster TV. Hey, it's Matt here with Adjuster TV and for the best tips and tools for getting on the first call list as an independent adjuster, subscribe now. Click on the bell notification so that you'll never miss a video. And thanks to DeathAngel745 from YouTube who says, so you may not believe me, but I watched every video in two days. Lots of good info. I appreciate the effort. Thanks for watching Death Angel 745. Ladies and gentlemen, that's how you binge watch Adjust Your TV. As part of our ongoing series on IA firms and the training available to you as new or not so new independent adjusters, in this video you'll get a behind the scenes look at Eberl's Dallas Training Center. We had a lot of fun shooting this one, so if you like bloopers, stay to the end. We have a state of the art training facility that we're really proud of. Um, we have a auditorium that is able to hold 130 people. So we were able to offer really large client certifications and trainings. We also have a software lab where we are able to train on our clients' softwares that they utilize, mostly Xactimate. Um, we have a warehouse that houses an adjustable climbing room. My name is Jeff Blaine. I'm the training manager here at Everett Claim Service. Safety should be on the forefront of your mind when adjusting at all times. We can train adjusters on an indoor climate controlled roof. This roof allows us to change the pitch for anywhere from a 612 uh, all the way up to straight up and down vertical. Uh, more than likely, you know, we don't get that steep, but uh, with the indoor climate controlled, we don't have to worry about inclement weather. You don't have to worry about classes being canceled. Um, the show must go on and our concern is making sure that our adjusters are trained well and safe so that you can continue to perform your duties out in the field. We also have a mock-up that is built from the framing members all the way to finished product. This mock-up is something that we use extensively in our training here. It allows us to take people that aren't familiar with construction and walk them through the processes to start getting that familiarity on how to do repairs. Uh, let's take a peek inside. We have a simple mock-up in here, but what this allows us to do is show you from bare framing how the house is built to the insulation processes. You'll see that throughout this uh, facility. And then we take our wall finishes in here. You can see our finishes start from bare framing structure to drywall, the steps of taping and texturing to the finished product. We also do that with our other types of wall finishes. We've got tile, green board, cement, fiber board over here because we all know that it's not just repairing the parts that we see, and we also have to understand the full process so that we allow for a correct repair. We take this same thought process and we use that on the exterior of this dwelling too. So if we walk through the doors here, you can see on the exterior, we do the same thing. We have several different finishes on this mock-up. Um, we have our stone and stucco, our vinyl siding, but you can see the breakaways that shows the different steps of that process. We spend a lot of time in Xactimate looking for items and product ID is going to be essential for that. This mock-up is built using Xactimate code so that it's going to help you be more familiar with that program. The faster you learn Xactimate code, the quicker you can write your estimates and that's gonna in turn allow you to make a little bit more money in the field. So a large portion of our industry is getting on roofs. So we spend a lot of time making sure that people are knowledgeable about roofs and safe on roofs. Again, safety is a huge issue here. Once we get up on the roof, we take the same processes that we've done here on the interior and the exterior, and we have breakaways on the roof to show you from the bare framing of a roof structure all the way to the finished product so that you can start again to be familiar with those items. And up on there we have those labeled with the Xactimate code so that you know where to find those in Xactimate as we're doing our mock estimates in here. Um, we also have a residential scoping room in which it is set up to be a master bedroom and the room in and of itself has a bit of complexity to it and we will, or the adjusters are able to come out here, measure and take that information that they obtain out here at our residential scoping room back into the uh, prospective program and build a good quality claim file. We also have trainers on staff that are walking them through the process every step of the way.
away. So once we've completed the mock-up in here, we've understood the construction process, how to make those repairs, the process that it takes to make that repair complete, we're gonna move into our next mock-up. We have a fully functioning mock-up out here. This mock-up is intended to resemble a master bedroom, a bathroom, a hallway, walk-in closet. And we're gonna give you mock-up claims out here. We're gonna ask you to identify damage. Um, you're gonna have to scope that damage, measurements, getting that information transferred from your scope sheet into an Xactimate program. That's something that we can do fully in-house here. Um, we do role playing. We'll have a policy holder here for you. We also have somebody playing the role of a manager and making sure that you understand where to ask the right questions. Who do I ask questions? Is this something that I ask the policy holder or my manager? We want to help you guys become familiar and comfortable with those interactions. This mock-up also you'll notice we have a staircase over here. It'd be nice to take one of those with you out on the job, right? Uh, the staircase is intended to get our adjusters that are strictly focused on in-office only and have no desire to climb a roof, but we want to give them the opportunity to go up. We have a platform up there that they can stand safely, get an overview of the roofing system so that they have an understanding of what it's like to be a field adjuster or what it is that they're looking at when they're out in the field. But you can see we have a room here and we built this specifically not to give you just a flat basic room. We've got a square room, of course, but you notice we have a peak ceiling, which is a, a unique item when you're building it in Sketch. Uh, we want you to learn how to obtain these measurements. You're gonna have to collect all this information on your own, and this is where we start to get you uh, involved in that. How to sketch this room, um, identifying damages, what's gonna be involved in repairing that damage. And we can do that. We move stains around in here. We have portable stains or movable stains. We have some different types of flooring. We have transition from a carpet to a vinyl flooring in here. So I need to be able to address that. Um, also the different components to what's happening in here. The type of drywall I've got, the type of trim boards that I've got here. So as you can see with all of our mock-ups, we're here to train our adjusters. If you don't want to climb roofs, we also have in-office claim handling environments that we have trainings for as well. So if you want it more for the in-office piece of things, we, we've got just the training for you. Um, but also we have auto opportunities if you don't want to climb roofs and that's not really your bag. We've got um, an auto um, warehouse where we are able to train on the auto software. We also have a mock vehicle. Um, it actually runs, but it has hail damage and fender damage so that we are able to train adjusters on how to, you know, look at a vehicle, whether it's in a drive-in or out in the field. Uh, for those of you who do not want to work property, work auto claims. Uh, we teach you how to scope the damages uh, as well as complete an uh, actual estimate to give you practice on uh, writing flood estimates hail damage estimates, collision damage estimates. Um, and then we also have a call center. Welcome to our Dallas call center. Not only do we host certifications and trainings for our various clients, but we also have a full service call center where our adjusters handle live claims. We have a capacity to seat 52 adjusters at a time. Everill Claim Service, since 1987, empowered by technology, led by compassion. Question of the day. Do you like bloopers? If you like bloopers and behind the scenes stuff, don't forget to hang out to the end of each video. There may not always be one, but then again, there may be. For much more information about crushing it as an independent adjuster, head on over to adjustertv.com. And if you got value from this video, you can help me create more videos just like this by subscribing to Adjuster TV on YouTube. Wondering what to watch next? There are tons more videos right here on the Adjuster TV YouTube channel. And as always, Thank you so much for watching and have a great storm. Why is everybody in here for mine, but they left Taylor alone? Well, that's what I want to know. No, you're good. Just don't make him faces. Okay. <clears throat> My name is Jeff Blaine. I'm the training manager here at Everett Claim Service. Yep. And then you can go ahead and... Okay. 
My name is Jeff Blaine. Uh, <laughs> My name is Jeff Blaine with uh, um, so that we can focus on training you. Uh, safety should always be on the forefront of adjusting. And safety should be on the forefront of adjusting. At, um, let's try that one more time. Led by technology, empower. Damn it, excuse me. <laughs> Not only can you come to our facility and have certificate, dang it, it was perfect the first time. Welcome to our Dallas call center. Not only do we host <clears throat> Everill Claim Service since 1987, empowered by technology, led by compassion. Yeah. Yeah. Whew, I started to sweat. I started to sweat, thank you. Good thing I have deodorant at my desk. Suddenly, the world I used to know, I see it differently. You woke me from a dream, now here's reality. Baby, baby, you are really hurting me. My name is Taylor Jones, and I'm with Everill Claim Service, and you're watching Adjuster TV. Like, was this too much? Hi, I'm Sherry Thomas. Dag it, I forgot who I am. Okay. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Sherry Thomas, Talent Acquisition and Training Specialist with Ebro Claim Service, and you're watching Adjuster TV. Thank you. Thanks. Okay.